Rig crews use drilling mud, casing, and cement to manage pressures inside a well during drilling. Fluids contained within the pores of a rock formation exert pressure on the well bore that is known as pore pressure. The green arrows in this animation represent pore pressure. As rig crews drill ahead, they use drilling mud to balance pore pressure. The mud circulates down through the drill string and back up the casing to the rig. The weight of the mud balances the pore pressure, and the mud circulation carries away cuttings. The red arrows in this animation represent mud pressure. If pore pressure exceeds the mud pressure, fluids from the well formation can flow into the well bore, causing a kick. If mud pressure exceeds pore pressure, the formation may fracture, causing lost returns. As the crew drills deeper, the pore pressure typically increases. At some point, the rig crew can no longer use mud to balance this pressure without fracturing the formation above. At this point, the rig crew removes the drill bit and runs a new casing string. The crew attaches the top of the casing string to the well with a casing hanger. Then the crew cements the bottom of the casing string into place. The crew pumps cement down the drill string and through the casing. The cement flows out the bottom of the casing string and back up the annular space around the casing. In this example, the cement fills the entire annular space around the casing string. To drill ahead, the rig crew uses a drill bit to drill through the cement in the bottom of the casing string and ahead into the formation below. Hey there! Subscribe to my channel. And also press this bell icon. So you never miss any new updates cause whenever we upload new video you will get a notification on your phone.